What's up, y'all? Trey B. Devin in the building. Y'all know what time it is. Today's video, I'm gonna be installing a new sound system in the Prelude, man. So stay tuned. So before we get started, I do want to uh, give a shout out to all of my Trey B. Dipping gang members, gang, gang, gang. You know what I'm saying? Uh, AKA the members. So shout out to everybody who became a member this month. Uh, it's quite a few of y'all. Shout out to y'all. Um, I'm gonna have a, a giveaway pretty soon for y'all. It's not a whole bunch of y'all, but I'm gonna do something special for y'all, for those of, uh, of y'all who, you know what I'm saying, became members, so appreciate y'all. All right, so um, I'm not gonna do a full tutorial because I already actually have a full tutorial on the channel, so I'll put a link to that in the description if you wanna know the ins and outs on how to do this. This is gonna be a quick little video. So I already took the old speakers out. What are these called? Polk? I think they were a pretty decent brand back in the day. Um, the, the ones that weren't blown were actually pretty good, but um, two of them were blown. And then going ahead and replacing them with them kickers, you know what I'm saying? CSC65. So if you all wanna, by the end of this video, you're interested, I'll have a link to these in the description. But yeah, with that being said, let's move on to the inside. All right. So, like I said, I'm not doing a full tutorial. This is actually going to be more or less a review because I actually put these same kickers in my other Prelude. And they work great. They sound good. And the price is lovely. So, that's a quick look at the new speaker installed. I got four of them all the way around. You see up top. And then you can see the other one over there. You know what I'm saying? For my day ones, you guys know that uh, this is the radio that I had in uh, in my other Prelude before I upgraded to the big screen. And uh, I was actually going to put a big screen in this one too, but then I realized that I had this radio sitting around. And ain't nothing better than free, my boy. You know what I'm saying? Some of the recycled uh, parts from the other lube. But, uh... I'm gonna turn this joint on, let you guys um, hear what it sounds like. All right, so um, like I said, Kicker is a Kicker's been around for a long time. I've bought multiple sets of their speakers, man. Like I said, I have these exact ones in my other prelude, so I already know they hit, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I'm gonna press play and we're gonna turn it up and I'm gonna do a quick review on it, man. Um, yeah. Okay. Moving this shit would be doing inside of a movie. I believe what it does. Yeah. Ain't been no games in the shit. I got that work of Apollo to hit him up. Chill out for that copyright hit. Hey, that joint sounds so good, yeah. What? No, no, actually, these sound better than my other ones. I ain't gonna lie. Maybe that's a different um, model or maybe an upgraded version of the old model I have. These joints sound good. So, um, yeah, man, I can't complain. Not one bit. It sounds good. The mids and the highs are, like, amazing, to be honest with you. Like, I, I can turn it. That was, like, so the max volume is, like, 40 on this radio. That was at, like, 33, 34. Let me double check. Yeah, that was at 34. So almost all the way turned up. No crackling, no hissing, no nothing. That's so that's that's crazy. Um the price is lovely. Uh I got them. Like I said, the link for the speakers will be in the description. And I I give the quality. Honestly, bro, I can't hate 10 out of 10, especially for the price. The price is so lovely. And then the quality is there. The install, super easy. So I can't complain, man, to be honest with you. But yeah, with that being said, I'm just doing a quick video. Um, just kind of keeping you guys in the loop as far as what's going on. But now the loop is going to have a premium sound system. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I love it. Yeah, one more thing I didn't, I forgot to show you guys. One other thing that I added when I did the radio and all that. 
oh yeah, that boy got a backup camera. Okay, you know what I'm saying? Depth perception. Don't judge me. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to hit no whatever them little parking concrete slabs are. I don't got no business hitting them joints. So I went ahead and installed the rear view camera, man. That's crazy. Looks good though. But yeah, man, that's pretty much it. So if you guys like the video, hit that like button. And you see that right there? That's the subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Like the bride in my two-seater